Hard 8. What's good, people? Y'all know what time it is. Time for me to deliver. <laughs> the truth for you two. Yeah, what's up? It's me, Hard 8 Times. The truth for you two. Your favorite commentator's favorite commentator. Yeah, what's up, people? What's happening? I want to holler at y'all about something. I think I found the solution to dead subs. Yep, yep, I think I found the solution to dead subs. And I'm going to let y'all in on a secret, man. This shit really should be sold and not told. But since I'm cool with y'all, I'm going to let y'all in on a secret. For anybody that's getting into YouTube, to anybody that's already in the YouTube, let me let y'all in on a secret to... Dead subs, I have a solution. Yeah. Uh, there is no solution. <laughs> Dead subs are here to stay. They are not going anywhere. And uh, it's unavoidable. It's inevitable. So, there is nothing to be caught up over anymore about this whole dead sub situation. Everybody has dead subs. I have dead subs right now as I speak. Everybody has dead subs. But I'm but I finally got over the phobia I had towards dead subs, man. I really dread dead subs. And it was and it got to a point where I wasn't doing certain things because of the fear of, you know, receiving dead subs or getting dead subs in the you know in the long run. And uh, like, for instance, I was already supposed to do a dual con with NASA one and that cool black guy. Shit was already supposed to be done. Pretty much because of my phobia of dead subs, I haven't made it happen yet. You know what I mean? They pretty much waiting on me. Now, I haven't been, you know, really avoiding the dual cons, but I also haven't been trying to put forth the effort to actually make it happen. Because the shit could have happened by now. You understand what I'm saying? But me being so afraid of this whole dead sub thing, I never, you know, really tried to make it happen because I felt like if I do these dual cons with them, I'm going to receive a lot of dead subs. You know what I mean? So now I'm, I'm, I'm over it. I'm over it. Fuck it. You know what I mean? I thought about this shit. Dead subs is inevitable. They're going to happen. You can't avoid it. There's nothing you can do. Now, you can keep it to a minimum. You know what I mean? You can try to keep it to a minimum, and that just goes by, you know, not doing dual cons with certain people. Like, doing dual cons with somebody that's the total opposite of you, that can be potentially tragic. Like, if I was to do a dual con, say, uh, Woody's Game Attack, we are opposite commentators. We do totally different things. Yes, a lot of his subs might come and sub to me. Because I'm doing it with their favorite commentator. Because he told them to. Whatever the case may be. But at the end of the day, they're going to end up inactive. Because I'm I'm not what they into. They into, you know, Woody style. They're not into my style. You feel what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, most likely, they're going to end up inactive. You feel me? So doing a dual com with Woody's Gamma Tag wouldn't benefit me. Because I'm not going to receive much off of it. You know what I mean? In the end, I'm just going to have a bunch of, you know, dead subs. But this is the thing. Dead subs is not a bad thing. Just look at it as, listen, this is the number that I accumulated through my, you know, through my time on YouTube. You know what I mean? If I got, you know, uh, 50,000 subs and I'm only getting 5,000 views, then cool. I was able to get 50,000 people to subscribe to me. Now, they may not be watching anymore, but that's cool. You know what I mean? It's still an accomplishment. Whatever your number is, it's still an accomplishment. But every a lot of people dread the dead subs. That's why you're seeing Fist trying to go take the steps that he was doing to delete all his subs just to get back an active sub. I mean, just to get back active subs. But at the end of the day, after he would have did all that, he would have ended up with dead subs down the line. So, you know, he would have been doing that all over again. So the whole thing is... It's like, don't even waste the, the, the time and energy on thinking about dead subs like I used to. I used to always think about it, and I used to dread that shit. But now, it feels great. It's out of my system. I don't care about dead subs no more. You know why? Because there's nothing I can do about it. Nothing. There's nothing I can do about it. There's nothing that any commentator or anybody that do videos, there's nothing you can do about it. 
You can put out the best content every day. You can put out videos every day. You can do all that shit. You're still going to receive dead subs. I don't know why it's like that, but it just happens. I don't understand why a person would subscribe to you if they're not going to watch your videos. Like, I don't need you to subscribe if you're not going to watch. You know what I'm saying? If you're not going to watch, it's cool. You don't need to subscribe. You know, you can come back periodically and check out my videos. But if you're not going to watch, it's okay. You don't have to sub. I don't need to sub. You know what I mean? But it's all good, man. And there's a difference between dead subs and a dead channel. You know, if you got 50,000 subs and you're getting 5,000 views a video, yeah, you got a lot of dead subs, but it's really nothing to cry about. You still got 5,000 people that watch all your videos. That's a lot of people if you think about it. 5,000 people is a lot of people to just come and watch your videos. So it's really not nothing to cry about. You know what I mean? At the end of the day, it's not nothing to cry about. And there's people, a lot of people that wish they could get 5,000 you know, views a video. That's still a very active channel. You understand what I'm saying? Even though there's 45,000 subs missing. But that's still an active channel. 5,000 people is a lot of people. You know, now if you got say about, you know, 65, 7,000 fucking 6,500, 7,000 subs and you can't crack a thousand, you can barely get a thousand, then that's a dead channel and you might want to, you know, either fuck it, you don't care, or start over, or whatever the case may be, but there's nothing you can do about this whole dead sub, and I know a lot of commentators, you know, dread it just like me, but it feels better once you realize that there's nothing that you can do about it, so don't even worry about it, like... It's water under the bridge, ain't that's what they say? So, I'm cool now, man. So, I'm ready. I'm going to go ahead and make this happen. Nice and one knock come out. Cool black guy. Get them together. And, you know, whatever I receive, I'm thankful for. You know what I mean? If they stay and watch, if they don't, cool. I'm not going to worry about it no more. You know what I mean? There ain't nothing you could do. You can put out the best shit. Had the best editing. Using the best images. Whatever. Whatever you want to do, it's nothing that you can do to avoid dead stuff. So, this is your boy, Hard. Eight times the truth of YouTube. <laughs> Yo, shout outs to all my subs that was, you know, by my side through the whole ordeal that was going on. That is now over. We are now moving on. But shout outs to everybody that had my back. I appreciate it. And uh yeah, let's get 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 it. Uh Life Behind Bars coming soon. I can't say it's gonna be my next video, but it's coming soon. Just just, just be patient. Y'all know I like to build up the life behind bars. You know what I mean? That's the best thing I got going, right? So I like to build anticipation, but it's all good. Uh, yeah, check me out on Twitter. Hit me up, you know, uh, Xbox, PlayStation. Y'all know the day. It's your boy, man. Let me know what y'all think down in the comments. I know a lot of y'all don't make videos, so I guess y'all wouldn't even give a fuck about dead stuff. But I have seen people comment like, oh, you got a lot of subs and these little bit of views. What do y'all think? Let me know in the comments. Let's try to keep it clean, people. And, uh, yeah. It's your boy, Hard 8. Deuces.